So I'm clappy for Mark Christie and Bandit. I don't have that line for ages. I tried that at the stand and it didn't work. Uh, you know, I, it's only because of the comedy night is why I said that. Um, I'm not used to that term either. I'm a new dog owner. This is Bandit. She's uh, one years old in two weeks. Ah. So I'm not used to it when uh, dog owners, like people that know dogs, come up to you and go, "Hi, is that a bitch?" And I'm like, "Well, she did shit on the carpet, so I would say that she is." Uh, yeah. So me and Bandit, we've got a list for you. Because uh, we're trying to write jokes, but uh, lists were all we could do, so bear with us. Our list of people without a first name. Mr. Blobby. Mr. Bean. Mr. Brightsight. All of the Mr. Men. Dr. Noodles. And Mississippi. Thank you for that, that one clap for that list. That was good. Uh, me, me and Bandit wrote that t together. Uh, so Bandit, is a, she's a cockapoo. Um, and she's wondering what the hell's going on over there. Yeah, uh, she's a cockapoo. And it's not like that's a, a... They were invented in the 60s, cockapoos. Invented. Uh, what do I mean? What, you know what I mean. Right, so they, were, they came up with them in the 60s. And it's not like cock and poo meant different things back then. It's not like hundreds of years ago when cock and poo meant something else. No, I literally have a shit-covered dick for a dog. <laughs> and I come from a, a working-class background, a working-class family. I'm actually so working-class that when I was born, my mom went into manual labor. <laughs> yeah, my mom is lovely. Um, I'm actually vegetarian. Any vegetarians in? Yeah, some... <laughs> Boo the vegetarians, it's fine, they can't fight back, it's fine. Double the energy. Uh, I used to be, be vegan for a little while, and uh, my mum was quite worried for me. I know. Uh, my mum was quite worried for me. Don't worry, the bones break easy. Uh, so she, uh, she bought me a microwave meal. She was, she, she was like, Mark, there's, there's no milk, there's no eggs in this, you can have this. I'm like, mum, it's chicken curry, it's not going to fucking have this. I have a niece and nephew, uh, they're the cutest little things. Not as cute as Bandit, of course, but uh, they are quite cute. But they're obsessed with the Illuminati. He's running about shouting, Illuminati this, Illuminati that. And so I asked my nephew, do you even know what the Illuminati is? And he said, it's a massive wave. I'm like, no, that's a tsunami. Uh, so yeah, we're trying to potty train Bandit. She's, she's a year, she's getting, she's getting good, but she still does shit in the house. Uh, we, we took her outside uh, and she peed against a war memorial. It turns out she hates the vets. <laughs> yeah, so, so I think I've been carrying this bandit, haven't I? I've been doing all the jokes here, and you just wonder about doing nothing. This might be a double act. Have you got some jokes? Have you got some jokes? <laughs> oh, oh, I don't know. What do you call a wizard dog? Oh, Bandit, oh, Harry Potter. <laughs> that doesn't work. They can't read that joke, Bandit. That's terrible. Oh, okay, have you got another one? Have you got another joke? Bandit, come here, come here. What's that? What's I don't know, Bandit. Why did the dog go to the dentist to have her babies? Because she needed her canines removed. Oh, Bandit, that was really cute. Have you, got another, have you got another one? You've got one more. you got one more. Okay, so a British, a British bulldog, a Scottish terrier, and an Irish setter walk into a bar, right? Okay, what happens then? Oh, bandit. No, I cannot repeat that. I'm sorry. I did not know I had a racist dog. Uh, I do apologize about that. Uh, I'm not going to repeat that. Uh, we, we've got uh, another list. This is harder with a dog, by the way. <laughs> list number two, my list of people with no last name. That's one. Then there's Sting, Prince, Madonna, a lot of musicians, uh, Chewbacca, Babe, Loves pig in the city, that dog there, yeah. Drake and God. Right, we're going to finish up. We're going to try and do a wee craft show because I did say I'm working class, but I've got the fucking poshest dog in the world. She gets into fights by doing this with a lot of paw. Right, so, man it.
only knows one word as well. Let it treat. Here we go. Let it sit. Right, band it. Band it. Spin it. I'm really sorry. Uh, we've got one last list, right? One last list. Bandit wrote this all by herself. Was that, do you like Bandit? Oh, you're speaking to the dog, that's fine, okay. <laughs> Everyone likes Bandit. Right, my list of people with too many names. Edgar Allan Poe. Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the Son of God, our Lord and Savior, Almighty One. Queen Daenerys Stormborn of the House of Targaryen, the first of her name, the Queen of the Andals, that dog's a Game of Thrones fan right there, the Reiner and the First Men, Lady of the Seven Kingdoms and Protector of the Realm, Lady of Dragonstone, yeah, it's still the same name, yeah, uh, Queen of the Marine. Khaleesi of the Great Grass Sea, which just land in it. The unburnt, breaker of chains and mother of dragons. Benedict Cumberbatch. I've been Mark Christie. This has been Bandit. Thank you so much.